They what? smell the same. What are you doing? They smell the same. It's amazing. So Kim, hello. We haven't hello. said hello in a while. Hello. Hello. How are you doing? Great. How are you? Wonderful. Wonderful. Awesome. What did we get to play with this week, Kim? Today we are playing with the Kaveco. Kaveco. I would have said Kaveco. We haven't I know. been corrected. I know. Because oh. the pronunciation. Pronunciation police officer. Left town. Yeah, just, just got up and flew took the off. Coop. I know. So we get to say whatever we Some want. Some people, I tell you. <laughs> but the Kaveco Lilliput. Lilliput? Lilliput? I've heard Lily, it multiple ways. Lilliput or We would have asked. Lilliput. But we would have asked, but now so we don't know. Lilliput or Lilliput? The world will never know. They're, they're really cool. I like these pens. They're, uh, the nib on these are exactly the same as what's in the Kaveco Sport or Kaveco Sport yes, and all I sports. So. so it was a very, as far as writing experience, as far as the actual nib goes, oh, it was a very similar experience and uh, the writing experience in that regard was very good. Yeah, the nib was the same. The pen body, not the same. This the same. is itty bitty. I think this is like considered one of the smallest fountain pens. Especially, yeah, so when it's not little. when it's not posted. Yeah. Unless you have hands of a child, probably oh, yeah. not gonna be able to uh, to write with this too well. Like it doesn't even doesn't even rest yeah. into the uh, the first phalanx. I can't remember the what first it's web. The first web. Yes, the first web. It doesn't rest into the first web. <laughs> Quiet behind <laughs> set over there. We're trying to talk here. So we have a Kaweco All Sport yes. right here, and then here is the stainless steel version of the uh, the Lilliput or yeah. Lilliput. As far as length, um, the Lilliput's a little shorter, and then it's of course the diameter of it uh, is much smaller. Yeah, you have to post it. And Indeed. To post it, you don't just like cap it. You have to then. It's all threaded. Like the Twisby Vac Mini, which is nice because then the cap stays on. Yeah. I mean, there isn't an option to just set the cap off to the side. And as far as the the, I guess the the body itself it's all metal when I first started working here this was actually one of the pens that really really like like caught my eye I'm like oh my really? god this is so cool the copper one the one that's uh, that smells like pennies was the one that like really caught my eye I, I don't know it was just it's just a really cool pen. The copper one, for example, will get a nice patina on it after a while. Yeah. I think the patina is nice because it has yeah. like it's like a used pen in its character. But yeah. if you don't want that, you can just uh, polish it and uh, you don't have to worry about the patina. Should be good. Yeah. I think the copper is probably one of the prettiest ones. Mm -hmm. But like the copper, like holding it in my hand, it just it like hurts my teeth. Yeah. You know? <laughs> so Something about like the if you oh put my this god. Under your nose, oh my god. Just, you just pass so out. <laughs> So let's let's actually go through them all. Actually, all the ones we have here. So we have the black one. We have the black one. The black and the silver are actually really light. They're super I, I light. I think they're aluminum. I think. So this is an actual actual silver. It's uh, just made to look like silver. Mm -hmm. Then there's the um, stainless steel, which we had out earlier. Mm -hmm. This one is actually stainless steel. Um, so it's got some nice. Uh, Nice weight to it. I really like this one. That is a beautiful one. The fire blue. Indeed. Beautiful, beautiful color to it. I really yes. love that one as well. And then we have the brass wave. Here's the normal brass and then the brass wave. This one's really cool. It's got like this, exactly what the name says, just these little ripples and waves throughout it. When it's in your hand, um, the waves on there, it just gives it a nice little feel. It's really cool. Like a little cool. massage. It, indeed, indeed. For the first web. I know we talked about how they're mm -hmm. the same nibs as the other Kavecos, but they are steel nibs. Yep. I actually find fine and medium. Yep. When they're posted, they're just, yeah, they're just perfect size pens. The only thing I didn't like about these is right. that they don't have a clip. To be honest, I don't really use a clip that much anyways, because yeah. I just put it into my uh, pen pouch or whatever. Something you've brought up before is the fact that, you know, you set a pen on your desk and it's good to go. <gasps> these would just roll these would right roll away. Off. Yeah. And it'd be like, where's our pens? The nib noobs so have lost their pen. Oh, the wait, there's like 10 on the floor. There, yeah, there. they all just roll off. Exactly. Overall, these are these are really cool pens. And like I said, I, I would not mind having this uh, this copper one, actually. It's, it's a really nice pen. It's a nice writer, nice and petite. Teeth. Was that just your stomach? No. Maybe. You hungry? Yes, I am. It's, it's, it's late. You should have joined us for a croissant o'clock. I did not partake. Lisa was ready to beat me with a stick. Oh, see, I told you. <laughs> <laughs> Nib noobs.